this video presents how to calculate systematic risk of a stock using Excel built-in function slope. Systematic stock of systematic risk of a stock is also called a beta or the beta coefficient. The beta coefficient is a number that describes the relationship between stocks return and the overall market return. A high beta implies the stock price grows dramatically when the market is up and falls dramatically when the market goes down. Small values of a beta mean the stock's return is relatively unaffected by the swings in the overall market. Generally, a stocks with a beta of 1 is considered that it moves in tandem with the market whereas stocks with a high beta are more aggressive and stocks with low beta, low beta in the sense less than 1 are defensive stocks. And now we will see how to calculate beta using Excel. The equation for a beta calculation is beta equals to covariance of xy by variance of x. x here is market returns and y is stock returns. You need to keep in memory that beta is calculated on the returns not on the prices. It is calculated on stock returns as well as market returns. It is a relationship between market returns and stock returns. So beta is a measure that compares returns, not prices. So for this, first we need to calculate the return of return on market index as well as return on stock index. So how is it we are going to calculate a return is daily return equals to PT that is price of today minus PT minus 1 previous price divided by previous price and into 100. So here this equals to PT0 that is current price minus previous price divided by previous price into 100. So we calculate the daily return for market index. Similarly, I drag this to the right to calculate the stock return. Now select these two and Place on double click. So we got a daily returns for market as well as a stock. Now, once we calculate the returns, next we move to calculate the covariance. So, covariance of xy, we use built in equation COVR. So, here we calculate covariance of xy equals to COV. AR covariance covariance of array 1 pick the array 1 comma pick array 2 we got the covariance of xy next we need to calculate the variance of x for variance calculation we use excel function var equal to VAR and VAR we required for variance of X. So market return R X. So calculate the VAR of X and we got variance of X and now beta equals to covariance of XY divided by variance of X 0.932. Alternatively, instead of doing all this tedious calculation, we can simply use Excel built-in function slope, SLOPE, to calculate the beta. So here we do using slope equals to SLOPE slope. I ask you to known Y values. Y values are our stock returns, selected stock returns, Y values then known x values x values are market index values select a market index values and click enter so here 
we got a beta of 1. This is how we calculate beta or a systematic risk using MS Excel.